you have the loot. Loot crate, that is. And loot anime. Um, I got these both on the same day, so you're getting a double video. Woo! Uh, the loot anime is for... Uh, alternate... Alternate world or something? Alternate universe? And this is for role models. So we're going to start with the loot crate because that was the closer thing to happen. So, uh, yeah. Cut this one open. So yeah, you guys get two two videos in one. Isn't that amazing? Anyway. Alright, so this one is full of amazing, great role models. Uh, the first of which according to the shirt, is Deadpool. Last time we got a Deadpool shirt, it was pretty good as a chimichanga thing. But uh, now it's Taco! Taco surprise! <laughs> Pico boo! Um, <laughs> that's pretty amazing. Thank you, shirt. Uh, not thank you, shirt. Thank you, phone. I don't know, it just smells interesting. I don't know if there's something in here that's making that, but it smells like, um, I don't know, mint. That's weird. Then again, it's Deadpool, so maybe it's not weird. Um, but yeah, it's a, it's a nice shirt. It's always good quality from them, but it's a fantastic uh, design also. <laughs> I might actually wear this one. Uh, next up, we have a thing from Archer, a classic Archer figurine. I was actually just watching last night uh, the Season 8, Dreamland, uh, which is pretty good. I like classic Archer the most. I like Seasons 1 through 6, 1 through 5-ish. No, six is, is six was Archer Vice, and seven was, seven was that other one, I don't know. Anyway, um, it's, it's just a drinking Archer figure. Let's take that out so that the sun doesn't reflect off of it. But yeah, it's, it's him drinking and with his, his finger, I've just, <sighs> anyway, come on, focus camera, stop it. You focused for a second and then you stopped. What what happened? Come on. Come on. Focus on his face. I swear to God, camera. There we go. It's pretty good. Uh, I love Archer, though. H. John Benjamin is just a treat. Let's turn the sound off on my phone. H. John Benjamin is just a treat. And I love, I love him in Archer. I love him in Bob's Burgers. He's good in Family Guy, all-around fun guy. Um, also, like the rest of the cast, um, I don't know. I don't think they get enough credit either. Aisha Tyler and Chris Parnell and uh, everybody, everybody else. Uh, next up, we have Arrested Development. This seems to be a wallet with the. Uh, there we go. The uh, banana. Yeah, the Bluth Company banana stand mascot. And it has about as much money as the Bluths have. <laughs> There's always money in the banana stand. That's the card here. That's the film. There's always money in the banana stand. I told you there was always money in the banana stand! I had $250,000 cold cash lining the thing! Um, you also have a Punisher logo decal. So that's cool. Looks great on car windows, laptops, tablets, notebooks, binders. Alright, cool. Clean the surface before applying. Stickers won't apply well at less than 40 degrees Fahrenheit. Oh no! That's neat. See so yeah, the Punisher, also fantastic role model. Um, got the uh... oh, the loot pin is the Big Lebowski. Is the dude? Come on, focus, focus, camera. I need to work on this camera's autofocus settings. There we go. That's just like your opinion, man. I, I love that movie so much. Oh my gosh. Uh, also. A nice Deadpool 2 poster. Deadpool 2 was a fantastic movie. I have not laughed so much in years. Ah, oh, it was great. Ah, <laughs> oh, such a beautiful thing. I just, I love this picture also. <laughs> uh, 
and uh, just a thing on the bottom here talking about what's in the crate. Uh, role models? Question mark. Uh, May 2018. Ah, role models. The example we all strive to emulate. They're successful, virtuous, and pretty much the opposite of these guys. But we still love them. Celebrate these characters of questionable character with this awesome gear. Uh, Deadpool peekaboo t-shirt. Need, uh, need to add a little 616 on a flavor to your wardrobe? Surprise! It's everyone's favorite taco-loving merc with a mouth, Deadpool. And the Archer figure, you want an awesome Archer collectible figure? but Because this is how you get an awesome Archer collectible figure. <laughs> Some lucky looters, phrasing. <laughs> phrasing! May get a battle damage variant figure straight from the danger zone! Uh, they just... I guess I'm the... I got the battle damaged one? I don't know, he has stuff on his face. Are we still using phrasing? I really think we should bring back phrasing. Uh, exclusive rest of development banana stand wallet. There's always money in the banana stand, but when you burn that down, you can keep your cash in this handy banana stand wallet. And the big Lebowski pin. He's the dude, or uh, his dudeness, or duder, or el duderino, if you're not into the whole brevity thing. <laughs> this pin really ties the collection together, though. I'm just glad they didn't send me a marmot. Loot Crate Edition Punisher decal. Frank Castle is a man on a mission, and his mission is less than legal. Uh, bring the Punisher's infamous skull symbol to your laptop, notebook, or car with this decal. And the bonus, Deadpool 2 mini poster. Mount the Merc with a mouth on your wall, or whatever, we're not your boss. And make sure you catch Deadpool 2 in theaters. Yay for advertisements. Also, the box itself is Archer. Dee 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 Bum. Bum. I really like the theme. Anyway, uh, next up is Lewd Anime with the uh, alternate universe thing. We'll go over what's coming next month after we finish both of these. But anyway, do 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 things of all time. It's an anime, I guess. Um, but I have I have Blu-ray collections, right? I have Miyazaki movies. I have Trigun, Cowboy Bebop, and Fooly Cooly. Uh, that's it for my anime Blu-ray collection. And that's what I wanted. Uh, but yes, here's our Fooly Cooly shirt. Fooly Cooly. It's pretty good. The picture is... Not mounted right. I mean, it is mounted right, just the words aren't, but yeah. Um, yeah. Uh, Haruhi Haruhi Harahara? I think her, her name is, maybe, possibly. Um, but yeah, I love it. I love it! What was I looking at that reminded me of Fooly Cooly? Mm, I don't know. But anyway, uh, it's a nice yellow also. It's an interesting color. But yeah, um, if you have never watched Fooly Cooly, it's short. Uh, and it is amazing, and it is, it is, uh, it's made by Studio Gainax, I'm pretty sure, who did, like, Kill a Kill stuff. I'm pretty sure that's them. I could be wrong. I don't think I'm wrong. I could be wrong. You know what else I have? I don't have it on Blu-ray. I have it on DVD. Um, Excel Saga. Just to let you know my taste. Miyazaki, Cowboy Bebop, Trigun, Fooly Cooly, Excel Saga. Um, but yeah, uh, they're also making, the reason why they put Fully Cooly here is probably because of the sequel series that's coming out. That's interesting. Also, there's a hat this time, uh, from Monster Hunter Stories. So that's neat. Um, it's actually a very nice hat. That's the, I have, I don't, I haven't watched Monster Hunter Stories. Also, this is the first time I think that, uh, we've been sent a hat that's not one of those snap things that's actually like a bent brim so congrats you made me happy you make me so very happy um and next up is the ancient magus bride i believe yep manga so that's neat it's very interesting uh, art style I always like reading these, aside from the story itself, just to get, I, I say this every time probably, uh, just to get, like, ideas for, like, art 
design and stuff and it, like manga art design so it's pretty cool I will check that out does it have a, a blurb there's a little mini poster in the front also so that's neat does not have a blurb we'll probably get that later uh, the pin is cells at work I don't know what that is but it looks nice Man. Uh, next up we have a animation cell maybe from Mystical Girl Lyrical Nanoha Reflection. This is interesting. Uh, the box itself is Monster Hunter Stories. And let's see what the poster is. The po oh, yes. Poster makes me happy. Yep. Guy next. It's fully coolie. Fully coolie. It is a fully coolie poster, and this is definitely going up on my wall. I don't know what I'm going to have to tear down to put this up, but hell yes. Thank you. Like, the entire, the entire, uh, uh, at loot anime from this month was worth it just for this poster. I'm telling you guys, Fully Cooly is like, I saw it when I was like a kid, like a young kid. It was like one of those things where you're kind of just flipping through t the channels on TV in like, you know, 12 in the morning when you're, I don't know, 11. <laughs> and um, all of a sudden you just like come to that one weird scene. This one was like episode three or four, the scene where she's in the bathrobe or the towel and um stuff happens interesting things happen um it's a uh, metaphor for puberty um <laughs> uh so that was my introduction to fully coolie and i never forgot it and i came back and i watched it and yes i love it i love it so much but yes this poster i love it so much so it made my subscription worth it. But anyway, Alternate Universe, that's what it was called. From brave worlds to dimensions slightly different from our own. This month we're exploring anime and manga from an alternate universe. Transport yourself with items featuring stories and characters from imaginary realms. You never know where you might end up. So exclusive Fully Cooly t-shirt. Sometimes you're just going about your day and sometimes you get hit by a Vespa riding pink haired girl who turns your forehead into an interstellar robot portal with a bass guitar. Show your love of Fully Cooly and your excitement for the new season with this tee featuring the Fully Cooly cast and logo. God, I love that show. He's a hero from the future. God, the music is so good too. He's a da, da. With the, the ending scene. The ending theme though. So good, so good. I'm sorry. Loot Crate Edition Asian Magazine Bride Volume One Manga. In alternate universe where the magic still exists, Chise Hatori, a troubled orphan, is sold to an ancient mage. Will she enjoy a fantastical new life as his apprentice, or one shrouded in darkness as his bride? The special edition of Angel Magazine's Bride Volume 1 by Kari Yamazaki comes with a loot, cra loot crate exclusive cover. Exclusive cells at work pin show germs, viruses, and other bacteria. Who's boss with this pin? Featuring the manga cover art from Cells at Work Volume 1, which you can get digitally. Um, exclusive Monster Hunter Stories Ride on Baseball Hat. There's also a um, light colored one. In a world filled with monsters, it always pays to have a trusty companion by your side, particularly when that trusty companion often carries donuts. This baseball hat features an embroidered Navaru in one of two variant expressions and colors. And Magical Girl Lyr Lyrical Nanoha Reflection Art Print. Join Kiri and Iris from the planet Eltr Eltria. On their, on their quest to a strange planet known as Earth, <laughs> uh, where they must work to save their dying homeworld. You will receive one of three Magical Girl Etc. art prints of colorful character sketches. So that's pretty cool. Um, so yeah, uh, I just, it's very nice looking. I, I like the different colors uh, of just how the how they went about drawing it all but uh yeah so that's it for this month next month's loot crate is going to be colossal featuring jurassic world ghostbusters godzilla marvel and more 
Um, so if you want to get in on that, there will be a link in the description, as always. And next month's loot anime is Action, featuring Naruto Shippuden, Alita Battle Angel, Claymore, Jun Juni Tyson Zodiac War, and Goblin Slayer. Uh, so that's going to be pretty fun. So yeah, thank you all very much for watching. This has been Sephiroth 204 with Loot Crate and Loot Anime. Uh, some good stuff this month. Some good stuff this month. Goodbye, everybody. Bye-bye.